right, so now it's probably, what, three days later maybe, something like that. We're gonna first take our measurement for on day 20, 40 to find out who our winner is. This is strictly, like I said, it is what it is. I'm measuring it myself. Kate's doing the videotaping, so it's not gonna be a perfect measurement, and that's whatever it, the OTT comes out to right now, that's just what it is for the winner. So, here we go. We measure it around here, go around there, all the way around here, and oh, it slipped down. Yeah, we'll do it again. Sorry about that. Let's try it again. It's, it's so hard. It's such a different pumpkin. It's so difficult to measure this thing, especially when you're trying to measure it yourself. There we go. Um, I don't know. Is that? Are you holding me good? Yeah. Um. Well. Is that? Yeah. Hold it good and tight there. I, uh, I, I didn't have anybody helping me earlier this morning when I first measured this and it wasn't this big. Well, it's a little bit bigger than I thought. There you go, Kate. Okay. Oh. Uh, Kate he, he's count. got the mark. I got the mark right there. We're going to call it 144 and a half. Dang. Yeah. He, it's a measure tape. It's like 144 and a half. And now. We're gonna do our over the top. We'll here. have to get another measuring tape. Yep, we're gonna do this is the last time for this girl. Like I said, I measured it this morning. Just came out here by myself, and it was it, I I measured it at 141. So I just gives you an idea of how difficult it is to measure this. Okay, come around over here to the other side, Kate. Especially when you're measuring these yourself. Very very hard. There you go, right at 99 inches. I can't see anything. Can you see that? Oh, sorry. Um, it's right. 99 inches. 99. Right there. And then this one here. We'll go over the top here. <clears throat> Once again, just take my word for it. I'm going right down, touching the ground. Here, I'll get It doesn't this side. really matter because it's whatever everybody else, what the guesses are. It's not a big deal, right there. Okay, <laughs> come over here. And it is... Right, we're gonna go eight, right at 89. 89. 89. So there we go. So what do we say? 144 and a half around... Oops, sorry. Um, 144 and a half around the guy. Oh, there. I think I had it upside down. Sorry about that. 144 and a half around. 99 over the top. 89 from stem to stem. So, what does that equal? Just a second. All right, so we just did the measurement. It came out to 844.1 pounds. So whoever guesses is closest to 844, you can go over, you can go under, it doesn't matter. You just have to be the closest to 844.1 pounds. All right, congratulations to our winner, whoever it is. Uh, yep. We'll find out. We don't know yet, but we'll know in a few days. Yep. Bye. All right. And our winner, so we just got done measuring it, and it was 844 pounds. 844.1 pounds. And we had a winner that was 844 pounds. It was 0.1 pounds off, and the winner is Daryl Cron. So congratulations, old Daryl Cron. You give me an email, shoot me an email, get your information, we'll get you a seat out of this girl when she's all done, and don't forget, you're in the drawing for the... Pumpkin Challenge. Oh yeah. And of course, we're a few days later, so we want to see what the pumpkin weighs, and you can see from our beer bottle, what do you think, Elsie? Is it bigger or smaller? It's bigger. It's bigger? Yeah, can you get out of the way so the camera can see it a little bit? Yeah, step back there. So. Here we go. We're going to unveil the pumpkin today. Check it out. See if she's done growing or if she's getting bigger. Give it a hug because we've got done watering. There you go. Get that off. All right. There it is. So we got a little issue. Not a major issue, but it's an issue. All of our stuff, the styrofoam. Can you see it down here, Phoebe? 
styrofoam that it's sitting on is almost too far overlapped. The pumpkin's hanging off of that. So we're gonna have to add some more styrofoam, some more sand. That's a good thing. Um, back here, I'm not gonna bring you over there. We're gonna let Phoebe stick. But the uh, main vine, it's starting to push again this way, starting to get, so I'm gonna have to move this girl again. I don't know, might have to get a bigger strap for that. But, like we did in the past, Cade, what you got in your hand there? Tape measure. Tape bigger measure. One. A bigger one, because if you would have saw our videos, our tape measure wasn't long enough. So can you hold that for me, Elsie? And can you switch back there with where Cade is? Kind of switch spots. Cade, you're going to help me measure this. So scoot back a little bit, Elsie. Cade, why don't you get over there? And... Just like in the past, Phoebe, go ahead and just look at the plant here. Like point it there? Yep, point it over there. Let them see the plant over there. Let them see the plant here. Plant back over here. Yep, nice and slow. And now if you can tell, there isn't any vines growing right now. The vines are good. The vines have finished filling in everywhere that we're allowing them. There's just a main vine stuck back there. You can't, you can't see it. It's fine. It's back over there. It's the only one growing on the plant right now. So that's it. What we got is what we got. So here we go. Hey, let's check this out. So, hey, here you go. Get her all the way down there. Reach your hand way over here at the end. This is extremely hard to measure. We're gonna do our best. Okay, okay, down a little bit. Can you go down a little bit with your hand? Sure, it's good enough. So there we are at 12 foot, almost eight inches. So 12 foot is 144, eight more inches is uh what eight and 144 is 152 inches today and then down here this one measures oh you pulled it there you go it's hard to see again we go put it out of there it's like uh, went to the nine and a half, so well, what are we at? Seven foot is uh, 84 and then about 10 inches, so almost 94 inches that way. So we said, what would you say? 152, 94, and let's see what we got over here. Watch out here, guys. Get back to the middle. Now, don't hug your pumpkin. Like Bubba always says, don't hug your pumpkins. Let the tape measure do the work. You don't want to hug a pumpkin. That people look at you weird. And that goes to nine and a half, so eight foot, nine inches, 96 to 105. So 105, 94, 152. It, it's probably really close to measuring a thousand pounds today. I'll have to do the math here in a little bit, maybe do a quick uh, video. So let's pause it right here, Phoebe. All right, so we just looked it up and it comes out to 994 pounds, which is right at a thousand almost. So she's about doing 40 pounds per day. It's That's beautiful. Not yeah, not quite, 38, 39, which is amazing for us i mean at this stage we uh, after day 40 we're doing 20s or low upper teens yeah it's not good at this stage normally it's slowing down so if we're doing 40 pounds per day that means that this girl will be measuring a kansas record here in about what is that 10 would be 400 no so uh five for so about a week from today it'll almost be measuring maybe two maybe a week and a half maybe 10 days from now hopefully this girl's raising measuring the new kansas record and hopefully she's a rock so maybe she's doing more than 40 pounds per day who knows 
We normally go two scale or no real little light, so she could just be right on a thousand pounds today. So there you go, guys. Congratulations again, Daryl. See you guys Bye. in the next one.